All right, guys. So I'm out here watering. Look at these. These are my um, ground cherries. Look how good they look. And guess what I found? One of them fell off and there's more. So I'm gonna pick these up. And from what I've heard, if you leave them in the husk, they last a long time. My husband's not home today. He's at work and I know he's gonna wanna do the taste test with me. So I'm going to pick these all off and then I'm gonna save them till he gets home. Oh, how exciting. I did it, guys. I'm so proud of myself. Another thing I wanted to say is that they say they're best when they fall off by themselves. So you don't wanna prematurely pick them. And there's, see, a bunch of them. It's what they look like when they're, so this is what they look like as they're forming. They're green. And then they kind of take on a yellower and sometimes an even like, what would you call that, peachy color? Some of them are peachy colored and some of them are yellow, but if they fall off, they say that they're ripe. That one's empty. Somebody got a hold of that one. Oh no. Don't you be stealing my ground cherries, chipmunks. I'm gonna come for you. Let's see if this one, look at this one. It's like massive. Is this one ready? Yeah. Yep, that one's ready. Sweet. Now it should be easy, right? There's my haul. Hi, everybody. Welcome to my channel. Stop it. Benjamin Michael Cordial, Ben okay. Mike Millions. No. Mm -mm. Okay, hello, everyone. Um, so the beautiful Ben is home from work, and we have the ground cherries that I harvested yesterday, and we are going to do a ground cherry taste test. These are Lowen Family Heirloom. Oh, I'm fat also. Okay. And they're still in the husk. Oh, yeah. This? Let's get a close up of that. Wow. So, oh, yeah. What is this? I've never seen anything oh, like this. Oh, I dropped no. it. That's pretty neat. Looks like a pumpkin. Some of them. It looks like a little hanging thing. So it's a little iron. So you don't eat the out, don't eat the outside. You take them out of. No. Can you eat the outside? I, I don't know. I wouldn't. But you leave the outside on until you're ready to eat them. That keeps them from going bad. Oh. But and these are on the ground? Peel them off like that. No, you hold it like that. No, do they fall on the ground? Yeah, they fall on them? the ground. No, uh, wait till they fall on the ground. I've never seen them. All right, is everybody ready? I'm ready. Okay, oh, do let's you, do I this. took mine all the way up. Oh, well, I use too. it as like a little handle oh, and then okay. I pop it off. Ready? Yeah. You gotta swirl it like a wine test. So smooth. Yeah. All right, here we go. Okay. Woo! Um, I don't think mine was. Does anyone have any words? Mine's tart. I want to try another one because that one was pretty tart. Mine no, was, it was a like, little tart. It was like super also, sweet at the beginning. Like, it tastes funny. It tastes like uh, something else. What like, does it taste like? Like a chip or something. That one. It does. It tastes kind of like oily. <laughs> it has like a mouth texture or something. Mm. Don't it? I really want to try. Tastes like that too. I, I really want to try be... the pineapple kind. Are they supposed to be like veiny like that? What is that taste? I don't know. It tastes like Olean, <laughs> that fat-free cooking oil. Yeah. Oh yeah. What is that? That's kind of. I don't know. They're not. So... They're not sweet. They're not sweet at all. Yeah, they are. All the, Mine was not. Tyler said it tastes like a tomato. And that's what all he mm, said. Here, tomato, try that one. Classic tomato so, flavor. So Ooh, that basically, weird basically weird that means he has a horrible taste buds. Ooh, man, they had like doesn't a taste weird... doesn't like tomato at all. No, it doesn't. I don't know what it tastes like. Mine tastes a little fruity. Yeah, I agree. That one had what a little kind of bit fruit of tomato pineapple flavor. Mm. That one I just had tasted a little pineapple. It did. 
Yeah, I can but see that. I can see a little pineapple. I, like a mango, maybe? Yeah, mango pineapple. It's got a weird, like, flavor. But even still, like, flat. I don't think I like them after they all don't. that. <laughs> like, I don't think they're kind of... Like, after all that, uh, trying and trying for years and years it's growing like them. It's oily on the outside. I don't... It, like, mm-mm. They're what about different. You? They're different. No. Uh, well, that, one that is weird. It's kind of like a. Well, now I know. Uh, I guess I won't try the. I won't grow the low end family heirloom next year. Maybe I'll try a different kind. Let Pineapple or too. Aunt Pineapple Molly's. People. I want to try a recipe, maybe like um, pie filling or Ooh. jam. If I, you know, if I have a, a bunch of them, but. Oh, I, like I gotta say, I'd rather have taste anything like this. I They're gotta just... say, I'd rather have a bowl full of cherry tomatoes than the ground cherries. It tastes like yeah. they went bad. Or something. <laughs> yeah, it does. It not really. Let's taste this. Let's I don't know. The but like, you know, yeah, let's see if the leaves are in. Don't eat the outside. Ew, that might be poisonous. I don't know. It's like paper. Probably. Yeah, it tastes like paper. You're weird. I'm not gonna eat the paper husk. If you it's called I'm a husk. Eating it, I'm just tasting it. They have a little shell. Okay, I'm done. I'm not down. down. I'm not down. Well, Maybe. you grow your own and make your own decision on them. All right. Well, this Please like and subscribe. Give it a thumbs up. Plant your finger on that like button. Plant your finger on that like button, people.